Hello friends, uh, welcome again and uh, this is my new project and it's a very interesting project that is the walk based e-learning system, right? The normally uh, this is a e-learning portal and the walk based means the walk stands for the visual and auditory and kinesthetic, right? Means uh, a student will register on the website and after that he will uh, give the questions, means he will participate in a quiz and on the result of that quiz, on the basis of that results, uh, we will provide the content. Means if he is good in the audio uh, presentations or he is good in the audio uh, learning, then we will provide him an audio learning platform. If he is good in the video learning platform, the video learning then we will provide you the video uh, provide them the video learning platform and if he is good in the textual learnings means if he if he's good in the readings the things then we will provide uh, him the uh, uh, textual things right so this is the main concept for devel developing this project it means uh, an admin or uh, author can add uh, the content means he will be able to add the content of video as well as the audio as well as the text for the same topic and according to the type means if students participates in uh, the quiz and he if he gets the video learning platform according to their choices then he will be able to get the video uh, content and same for the audio and the textual content so this is the main concept for uh, developing these projects okay so let's start with the project right so this is the home page of the project and the technology is and this project has been developed in php 7 mysql and uh, it it is running on the jam server but if you have the vamp server then you can easily run this project on the vamp server also and if you are using the linux machine then you can configure and run this project on the linux machine as well as if you have the windows platform oh, sorry a uh, mac then you can also configure this project on the mac platform <laughs> okay so it's compatible with all of your uh, operating systems so this is the front end sorry back end technology and the server side technology for front end i am using the html css javascript or and this is a bootstrap theme means according to the screen size it, the screen will be fitted out according to that screen okay okay so let's start the uh, functionality so this is the home page of the project as you are seeing this is the home page of the project this is the about us so this is the about and if you want to change this uh, content then you can change it also this is the contact us page so this is the real google map and uh, you can see this is the real google map and it will work only and only if you have the internet connection if you don't have the internet connection then this google map will not work this is the user login so there are two types of user login normally there are three types of user login the first one is the prof student the second one is the profession and third one is the admin means there is three role based system and the main advantage of this project is there are two ui user interface there is separate user interface for the professor and the student and there is separate user interface for the admin i will show you later okay this is the professor login so from here professor will be able to log in this is the student login from here student will be able to log in and this is the sign up form if you are a professor then you can sign up here right and this is the professor sign up form if uh, a student want to sign up then a student can sign up it from here right so this is both of the login okay and uh, let's go with the uh, professor login first right and i am logging as a teacher so this is the professor login page professor will get this dashboard after the login so what the professor can do this the first one the add the topic so professor will be able to add the topic suppose uh, this is suppose for the python right then python and the topic image if you want to add any image then you can add any of the image here and then this is python right then you can add the python here so the python topic will be uh, added here right 
and one more thing so there are these all are the topics and if you want to these are the there are two things right you can edit the topic from here right and if you want to add the chapters then you can add any number of chapters here right then how can you add the chapter so currently there are no chapters inside that's python then for adding the chapter you can add the chapter from here from here you will select a topic and type and after that you will be able to upload the file okay so uh, this is the add topics so and uh, this is the add chapter from where you will be able to add the chapter right and you will be able to also upload the uh, video file as well as audio file and the content will be displayed according to that and then this is the add quiz so this is the quiz part from where if a student starts learning that topic and after that he will get the quiz right to test his performance also there is a criteria if he doesn't get the 60 percent mark then he will be he will uh, he will be able to participate in the quiz again and again again and again till he doesn't get the uh, 50 percent sorry 60 percent marks right so this is a topic and this is the send message so this is the send message platform means just like an email message but we don't uh, we are not sending any type of email from this project so from here you are able to send that whom to whom you want to send the to send to user or send to the student if you want to send to the student then you will be able to get the all of the students list here if you want to send that to the teacher then you will be able to get the all uh, teacher list here so this is the sent message history from where you will be able to uh, check the uh, all of the earlier sent messages and this is the inbox if you get any of the messages then you will be able to get the details of that messages so this is the send messages this is the report part so from where you will be able to list out the topics so there are six topics if you want to delete then you can delete the topics from here also right and suppose this is a java and if you click on the chapters then you will be able to see the things so there are three types of video, uh, contents here the video and the uh, audio and the text right so if you want to edit then you can edit it also also for uh, audio and if so if a uh, video chapter is there then uh, video will be played if audio chapter is there then audio will be played and if java if the textual chapter is there then text will be played so this is the uh, topic report and the chapters and uh, this is the quiz report so this is the quiz so php quiz and java quiz and if you want to add the questions then you can view the quiz here and you can add the questions here also so you can view, view right and if you want to add the questions then this is the things right and this is the add so if you want to add the questions into inside that topic inside that quiz then you will be able to add the questions there also so this is the quiz report and this is the message report which i have uh, now say, uh, explained you earlier okay so this is all about the uh, uh, professor functionality and uh, and now i am going to wait so this is all about the professional functionality right now i am going to this is also my account from where professor will be able to update his account details in the logout section so this is all about the professor now i am going to log in as an admin right an admin so for admin this is the admin platform and the user id so i, I already told you that uh, there are two separate login for the uh, admin and the uh, student and the professor so this is the admin platform and this is the admin platform and what the admin can do this is the menu right so add topics so admin can add topics here also this is a topic report so this is the approved so this app this is the pending so none if any content is uploaded by the uh admin uh, sorry professor then it will be displayed to the student only and only if admin approves it without the approval of the content student will not be able to view that so this is the main functionality of this project right so this is a pending means this content will not be displayed by will be visible will be visible to the student and if admin want to delete it then admin can delete it also this is a chapter report so same for the chapter right so this is the pending approved so if you want to approve then just click on the approved and after that approved so this is approved 
if you want to approve it also then uh, let me show you the example also approved right so okay uh, so this is the chapter now i'm going to show you so the, this is the edit right so oh, this hello, is internet. The, yeah so this is the video uh, a chapter right you can see uh, this is the type is the video and admin can watch the full the most video. common so request i get is, is to do a java right. programming tutorial right. if in you which want i to teach the entire uh, language or the then core you can java language in one video so today i'm going to do that so let's get into it. it right all right so here i am in eclipse and if you don't know how to install okay. eclipse in and the description that of the video good, i provide then admin will approve it so same for the chapter let me show you the audio part also so this is the audio part so this is a text text part so this is the text part and uh, this is a chapter report and if i show you uh, the video part uh, sorry audio part well sorry, hello internet the, video the most let me i think this one right so this is audio part. well hello internet right. this the is most audio is playing right I get so, is to do yeah. all of the content is uh means according to the content this player will be loaded if uh, there is a text then text will be loaded if there is a video then video will be loaded and if there is a audio then audio will be loaded right so this is a chapter chapter and walk test so this is a walk report walk report means admin can add a set of questions according to that question uh, the uh, content will be displayed right so this is the walk report and he admin can add the walk test means to test the mentality and the uh, means the uh, learning capabilities of the student admin can add these questions right this is a student then admin can add the student and student reports this is the users from where admin can add the users and user reports and the my account this is the logout section so this is all about the admin platform now i am going to uh, uh, sign up as a student so this is the admin student and student name i think social and i am logging as a issue test confirm password test role number and i think Date of birth, you can add date of birth here, mobile number, anything you can. If you want to add the photo, then you can add the photo in here also. So I am adding the photo and this one, right? Submit now. I am logging as a Kishore and test. Right, so once I log in as a, uh, as if I sign up and if I log in as a uh, 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 login first time then you will get the message complete your work test first to start learning means the system is saying that what type of capabilities you have you you are able to learn the audio platform or the video platform or the textual what what's your capability according to that the content will be displayed so this is a walk test without it you will not be able to access internal pages so i am learning here right uh so i'm during the free time i must so this is some uh scenario by based questions means this is checking your behavior behavioral type of questions right so there are questions of 30 questions and uh, i'm setting out here i'm filling so according to which the most you will enter the uh text uh, content will be re rendered according to that means uh, if you have the most uh, videos type of answers then you will get the video function so i have um, answered all of the questions and if you didn't if you don't do this then you will get the error right and if you click on the submit then it's saying that okay you have a very short read and write learning preferences means you doesn't have the you don't have the order on the visual platform you are able to read you have the good in the read and write and if you click on the go to dashboard then it's showing that okay view all topics right if you click on the view all topics and if you click on the start learning then if you click on the read then this is the text base now what i am going to do that i am going to uh, set the um, set the result as a two means the video and let's see what happened here right so i am opening the database first so I'm going. I'm doing it in the background. So okay. So what I'm going to do is uh, 
I'm going to set as a some other right I'm going to so I have the read and write means uh, it's showing only and only the textual things right now I set it to the visible now I'm going to log in as the system again and view topics so this is the start learning and if you click well, on hello okay. internet so this is saying that i set it set the uh, vac result from the background and it's showing that uh, that video content right and now i am going to make it as a audio platform then the most common request so this i get is, is integrated, to do right a job. right now i am going to add as a uh, textual platform sorry audio platform so for setting it and now i am going to login as a uh, Kishore and test and view topics and now we start learning so if you can read then this is the well, hello internet right the most common request so this is the audio so this is all about the reading the things right now i am going to dashboard and view topics and start quiz so this is the quiz now you will participate in the quiz and after that you will get the result okay submit exam okay so you have participated in two quiz right quiz not and so this is the result and uh, sorry dashboards and i think so this is the result and wait uh, i'm going to participate in sorry no approved content found because there is no content for the php right Read, sorry view topics and start quiz so so you will select the things here and uh, the next questions are coming and submit exam okay i think there is okay so uh is not decided there is some issue i will fix it so now uh, you can uh, you will get the result here also right after uh, qualifying the quiz you will get okay you you are passed in this quiz right you will get the result there okay so this is all about the project the work based e-learning system and if you need more functionality in this then just put it into the comment i will incorporate those changes and i will make this project more better and better according to your requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest video updates on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much.